Top of the morning, guys. Welcome to Cassie Tarot. Um, I just jump in, right? Um, we're going to get this crack a lack, and we're going to start out with a prayer to St. Michael the Archangel. God bless. St. Michael the Archangel, defend us in our day of battle. Protect us against the deceit and wickedness of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And you, O Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, banish into hell Satan and all the evil spirits who roam through the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. Akmadamajama and our guardian angel. O angel of God, my guardian dear, to whom God's love commits us here, ever this day be at my side to light and guard, to rule and guide. Ach, Madama Jama, what's the energy? So we have the Page of Cups. Someone is offering you a cup of love. They're in love, and we have the three of um, swords. This could be a love triangle, right? So I'm just going to say... Either they're hurt or they have someone, right? But they want to offer you a cup of love. We're all mature, right? And this is bliss. This is sovereignty. Um, this is um, being very mature. And all everything to do with pentacles is money, home, um, security, right? Um, so beauty and um, home and family. Harness this energy of success, right? shit um the will of fortune this is good luck is coming your way karma and fate everything that you put out is now coming back to you the end of delays forward movement um shit somebody is checking out emotionally in love and they're already with you in their heart but they're moving towards you right and with this um, Wheel of Fortune, you can best believe this is love. And um, if anything was stuck, it's not anymore. They want to work with you, spirit, universe, Shiva, and they want to take you on be seen in public because they're in love, right? They might not say it, but this is the lovers. They making this choice to be in their king of wand energy to bring you into fruition, manifestation complete. And the high priest is bringing it from the 5D to the 3D to the 4D to the 3D. And um, they know a lot of shit. This is like being in the temple of Solomon and having all that knowledge, moon secrets, truths, revelations, also bringing shit into fruition, right? Fated, right? By God, having high standards, breaking generational curses. And this missed opportunity is now coming back. We're going to work with the cards that we have. So here's your story. This person, um, say they're married, say they're separated. The heart feels what the heart feels. You can't help it, right? If you love someone, you love them. Maybe this is someone from your past. Um, they're coming forward. Expect to hear from them. Um, they're in this energy right here, right? Where it's sovereignty, um, bliss, um, this person is able to do everything, but they do it with a smile on their face and because they want to and they have that power. Like I said, it's harness that energy. That power is there. And it's called the power of love, right? And these pentacles, cha-ching. I want to say to the office manager, thanks for hiring me. I love you. You're awesome. And it um, that's this with this... Um, Wheel of Fortune, um, what you put out is coming back to you, right? Like, all your good works is now, like, if it was a missed opportunity, the Lord is bringing that shit back, right? And and it's a lot of love. So what we're going to do here is, because we can see, um, drink some water, there's a lot of cups. Um, somebody's in love, and they're coming back to offer you this love, right? Um, the Empress, they think you are so fucking gorgeous, beautiful, mature, um, generous. Um, you take care of the home, family, business, the children. Um, you're very nice and gorgeous. Did I say that already? Well, this person is in this energy where they want to grow. Um, if you can get pregnant, um, like see me, I'm celibate, haven't had sex in years, but I'm old as dirt, so that's not a possibility. But if you can, um, you might want to protect yourself. 
But um, this person has that kind of love for you. Sometimes it's best to, um, I never use birth control or anything like that, or I wouldn't have 10 children, right? But um, wait, like to have children, enjoy each other first, right? Um, this is because you cut out what didn't serve you, people, places, and things. And here's the penis card, but you're leveling the fuck up, bossing up in love, right? And this person wants to make love to you. You've been gifted. This shit is um, fated. Oh, shit, we got a pair, the king and queen of swords. This isn't even going to be that long. We're at like five minutes or whatever. These are two very mature people who cut out shit in their life that just wasn't working for them. People, places, and things. But then... That allows this law of attraction to kick in and all your beauty to shine because you are raising your vibration in your highest vibration that's brought this in, right? And it's justice, amen, because you are healed. Hallelujah. And this lovers, this person is making a choice to come forward, so we are going to clarify that. And the cards are repeating themselves, right? Because this person has checked down emotionally the Eight of Cups twice. I'm sorry, I was looking for this card. So, the star being aligned with Source and Spirit, right? Amen. God is so damn good. But, okay, here we go. The High Priestess. This person has all the knowledge, right? Um, They're securing themselves. They've attracted all this shit, right? The Wheel of Fortune. The Moon. If you believe in moon magic, I do it every night. Um, you brought this person in, Spirit God, Universe, Shiva, this missed opportunity, the Sky Gods. This person is in love, but by you remaining strong and having high standards, um, this is the Hierophant, breaking generational curses and having high standards, and this Queen of Pentacles. Being in this energy, you, this person, you brought them into fruition, right? They're coming with this Ace of Wands. They want to make love to you, the King and Queen of Swords. This is a mature individual who was healed, and it's justice, right? God is so damn good. Um, Let's get one card um, for energy, overall energy of this King of Wands. Um, Father, in the name of Jesus, he brings shit into fruition because it could be... um. The lovers is Gemini, but the King of Wands is Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries doesn't have to be. The Ace of Cups, this is a gift from God, love on the fuck up in love. But you are being gifted, and there's two Aces here, so that makes it a yes, right? Anytime you have two Aces, uh, that means, where's my Ace of Wands? That um, that's a yes. We have the ace of love and the ace of penis, right? And this person does want to make love to you. It is justice, having high standards, um, bringing shit from the 5D to the 4D to the 3D because you are so damn beautiful, capable. They're offering you this cup of love. It is um, karma and fate. It's a fated love coming in, right? And in the Queen of Pentacles energy, money's not a problem. Um, you used your moon magic, stood in your power, both of you guys. And they want to work with you, spirit, take you out in public and shit. And this missed opportunity is missed no more with the star you are aligned with source and spirit. God bless you guys. Ciao. Have a wonderful weekend and I'll see you later. Lead with your heart.